is he coming through? Hey, Bluey. Oh, hi. I see you're playing with Rosie, but it's almost lunchtime. I, I bet you're hungry. Yeah, I am. All right, let's go and I'll, I'll get you something to eat, okay? Okay, just let me put Rosie away first. All right, you come down with and you've put Rosie away. Hey, Bluey. Hi. I put Rosie away already. Oh, what? That's this. Well, Bluey, for lunch, I made you a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. And some lemonade to drink. Does this look like a good lunch, Bluey? Yeah, it sure does. Okay, Bluey, here you go. Enjoy. Oh, I will. This looks good. All right. Time to try my peanut butter and jelly. Mm, 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 mm. Uh, uh, what's going on? <coughs> oh, maybe I just got some stuck in my throat. I'll try and I'm getting a drink of my lemonade. <coughs> maybe that will get it out. No, that didn't work. <laughs> My goodness. Louie, are you okay? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, no, Bluey. It's got to be the sandwich. Oh, no. Bluey. Don't freak out, but I think you may be having an allergic reaction to the peanut butter. All right, this is definitely an emergency. We're going to the hospital right now. Okay, guys, here we are at the hospital for Bluey. She just started eating her sandwich and then she couldn't breathe. I think she's having an, an allergic reaction, but I'm not sure. Oh, good. I think I hear the doctor coming. Thank goodness. Hello, what's going on? Oh no. Louie, are you all right? Since she's having a hard time breathing, I'll explain. I made her a peanut butter and jelly sandwich for lunch, and after the first bite, she immediately started having trouble breathing. I think she may be having an allergic reaction to the peanut butter, but I'm not sure. Oh dear. <laughs> Bluey, it's, it's going to be okay. You are definitely having an you know, allergic reaction. and but, but we can calm it down. You're going to be okay. Okay. All right, Bluey, we're just going to give you this. This is an EpiPen. It will help calm the reaction and hopefully get you breathing normally again. I'm going to poke it right here in your thigh. Well, it hurt. Only for, for a second, but that... And your breathing should return to normal, and the reaction should calm down. Okay. Oh, it will take a few minutes, but you should start feeling much better afterwards. Okay. All right, guys, it's been a few minutes now, and... Bluey is already feeling a lot better. She can breathe normally again. <sighs> yeah. All right, Bluey. Since you can breathe normally again, tell me how all this happened. While I was eating my lunch, it was a peanut butter and jelly, and when I took the first bite, I... I was coughing and couldn't breathe. I thought maybe I had gotten some of the sandwich stuck in my throat, so I drank some of my lemonade to try to... And get my throat cleared, but it didn't work. So that's how I knew something else was wrong, but I wasn't quite sure what. Oh, Bluey, that does sound very scary. I thank goodness you got here when you did. I know. Bluey, I definitely think, think you're allergic to peanut butter and need to be more careful from now on. Okay. So, Bluey, I'm going to give you this little bracelet 
We're going to put that on your wrist. What's that? This is a sticker sheet with all the different... Different foods that are to blame for... Our most food allergies that people have. Wow. Oh. I didn't know there... There was that many. Yep. It's true. Since you seem to be allergic to peanut butter, we will put the peanut sticker on on yours. Okay. All right. We got the bracelet on Bluey. Here's the little peanut on it to indicate in her allergy. Huh. All right, doctor. We know now that I'm allergic to peanuts, but what should I do? Well, Bluey, you are going to have to be extra careful with what you eat from now on, okay? Okay. If anyone offers you food, ask first if there are any peanuts in it. All right. And I'm also going to give you this EpiPen that you can take with you. So that if you do accidentally... Eat peanuts. You can have this to calm the reaction down a bit until you can get proper medical attention. And I put the EpiPen in this little waste bag so it's easier for you to take on the go. Okay. Alright guys, Bluey is feeling much better now and ready to go home. Yeah, I know now what I need to do. Well, because of my peanut allergy, I need to be a little extra careful. Yep. So the doctor get, gave me the, this waist bag with my EpiPen in it. And this bracelet. I don't need to wear the bracelet all the time. Just when I'm going someplace where I could accidentally come into contact with, with peanuts or foods containing peanuts. But this will let people know oh, about my allergy, so they know to be careful around me. Yep, that is right. Oh. Bluey, I'm so glad you're okay. That was really scary. I know. But if I'm being careful, it shouldn't happen again. I hope not, Bluey. Yeah, guys, do you guys have any allergies, like food allergies or anything like that? Let me know.